Yo, what is up, Patreon crew? Welcome back to a new round of Patreon requests submitted by you. Uh, so, first up, we have Lynn Otten, Yo request Counting Crows, Mr. Jones. I don't think we've listened to a single Counting Crows track on this uh, channel at all, dude. Like, uh, I might have heard some on the radio growing up, but um, the only memory I have of anything related to Counting Crows is that there was a Full House episode where DJ got concert tickets to go see them. Uh, I'm realizing now that might have been like a cross-promotion deal, but um, who knows? Uh, <laughs> I'm, pretty, I'm pretty sure it was. Anyways, let's take a hit and then we'll jump right on into these Patreon requests. And remember, you can get your own Patreon requests if you go on over to patreon.com slash johnslop. And uh, remember to leave a like as well. And a subscribe if you're not already. If you're not already subscribed, what are you what are you even thinking, friend? Please, it's free. Costs nothing. You get all of my uh, fabulous videos in your inbox. And uh, make sure to hit that bell. I also have Weezer's hash pipe stuck in my head. Yeah, first up, dude, we have Counting Crows. Mr. Jones, no idea what the song's about. Let's just, uh, we're going to dive into the music video. You know, but we're going to have to leave it a little bit, uh, see through here just to avoid some copyright stuff. So thank you all for joining for another Patreon request night. Lynn, appreciate you. Patreon number. Uh, let's jump into Counting Crows, Mr. Jones. Hey, real quick, whoa, this is like a really relaxing, like, uh, like chill kind of rock. Uh, it just has a very overwhelming, like, 90s feel to it. I wonder what that is. I can't really tell exactly. I think it might be like these vocals. These vocals are kind of sounding like, uh, ooh, a little bit like reggae inspired. Oh, I don't even know, dude. Uh, let's, let's just keep it going. You know, uh, I'm still figuring out a whole vibe of this, dude. Let's just keep it going. Mr. Jones, Counting Crows. Show me some of them Spanish dancers and pass me a bottle, Mr. Jones. Believe in me. Help me believe in anything. Cause I wanna be someone who believes. Yeah. Mr. Jones and me tell each other fairy tales and we still 
lonely So I'm never gonna be lonely I wanna be alive Yeah, everybody wanna pass this cats We all wanna be big, big stars Yeah, but we got different reasons for that I don't believe in anything And I, I wanna be someone Don't believe, don't believe, don't believe, yeah Mr. Joe, let me Stumbling through the body of Every step of the beautiful woman She's perfect for you Man, there's got to be somebody for me If I wanna be popular Mr. Joe wishes that he was someone just to Okay, so uh, when I said that this reminded the lyrics reminded me a little bit of like, or at least the vocals reminded me of like a little bit of like reggae, uh, you know, I think it's more blues, dude. This is like a more of like a blues pop rock kind of thing. Uh, honestly, the vocals are the best part of this song. Um. Yeah, no. Who, whoever this dude is, let's. What's what's the just the, the name of the people, dude? Let me just look this up real quick. Uh. Overall, great song, great enjoyable. I loved the bridge, nice lengthy bridge. Really soft, and then when it came back to the pop parts, it was nice and bouncy. I liked it a lot. Honestly, I became spellbound by uh, just how upbeat and how unrelenting the singer was in expressing themselves. Like, uh, even in the video, you can see it was like taking over their body. They were really feeling it. Um, vocalist Adam Duritz. Yo, so Adam Duritz, great vocal job, like... That created just the whole atmosphere. Something about the way you slurred your words. Uh, overall, just really into it. Performance. It was awesome. Whatever genre this is, dude. Like 90s. Oh, gosh. Yeah, what was this genre? Like 90s college rock? Mm. No, yeah, no, I I like it though. It's like college pop rock, dude. I don't know. <laughs> uh it it was it was fun. I like this a lot. Uh so, let me know what you think of this track. Let me know what you think of the Counting Crows. We we would be remiss if we did not check out the lyrics. I was down at the New Amsterdam Staring at this yellow-haired girl, Mr. Jones strikes up a conversation with a black-haired flamenco dancer. You know she dances while his father plays guitar. She's suddenly... she's suddenly beautiful. We all want something beautiful. Man, I wish I was beautiful. So, come dance this silence down through the morning. Cut up, Maria. Show me some of that Spanish dancing. Pass me a bottle, Mr. Jones. Believe in me, help me believe in something, in anything, because I want to be someone who believes. Yeah. Mr. Jones and me tell each other fairy tales, and we stare at the beautiful women. She's looking at you, oh no no, she's looking at me, smiling in the bright lights, coming through in stereo. When everybody loves you, you can never be lonely. What the heck is this song about? Oh, I'm sorry, I needed water. 
Oh, wow. This is a beautiful poem. And obviously, uh, they had a good opportunity to write a really strong uh, subversive poem here for the song, and they did it. Yeah, I wonder who wrote the lyrics on this one. Mr. Jones and me look into the future. Yeah, we stare at the beautiful women. She's looking at you. I don't think so. She's looking at me, standing in the spotlight. I bought myself a gray guitar when everybody loves me. I will never be lonely. Wow. And then the bridge, I want to be a lion. Yeah, everybody want to pass as cats. What? We all want to be big, big stars. Yeah, but we got different reasons for that. Believe in me, because I don't believe in anything. And I want to be someone to believe. To believe. To believe. Yeah. Mr. Jones and me, stumbling through the barrio. Yeah, we stare at the beautiful women. She's perfect for you. Man, there's got to be somebody for me. I want to be Bob Dylan. Mr. Jones wishes he was someone just a little more funky. When everybody loves you. Oh, son, just about as funky as you can be. So I'm thinking Mr. Jones is just kind of like a character to reflect everybody, every man, so to speak. Who? let's see what the Genius About section has to say. It's really a song about, uh, this is in quotes. Excuse me. It's really uh, a song about my friend Marty and I. We went out one night to watch his dad play. His dad was a flamenco guitar player who lives in Spain. And he was in San Francisco in the mission, playing with his old flamenco troupe. And after the gig, we all went to this bar called the New Amsterdam in San Francisco on Columbus. And we got completely drunk. And Marty and I sat at the bar staring at these two girls, wishing there was some way we could go talk to them. But we were too shy. We kept joking with each other that if we were big rock stars instead of such loser low-budget musicians, this would be easy. I went home that night and I wrote a song about it. <laughs> wow. Okay, so it's a lot more simple, but just very, like, poetic. Gosh, and therein lies the beauty of art. Like, you can just write a song as simple as recalling a night that you couldn't talk to a couple of girls. And it just becomes this, like, big pop hit. Uh... Okay, well, that's that's awesome. Uh, what do you have to say? What what else do you have to say about this song, Mr. Jones by Counting Crows? Thank you all for joining. Make sure to leave a like, 